There comes a time in your life when you have to stop and think about the bigger picture. Hello, Make room for these. Family has always been important to us. We've always wanted the very best for our girls. Didn't bring anyone, darling. Don't start. We have. Oh, 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 why are we even here? I thought Dad hated barbecues. He does, ever since Uncle Tony burnt the pergola down. Hey, come on, that was years ago. That was last year. I think you're right, Carl. Something's definitely going on. My kneecaps are tingling. Steve's got really sensitive kneecaps. Yeah, usually before something big happens, like before Lucy came home and told me she was pregnant. Kneecaps tingling all day. He's such a freak. No, it's, it's true. It's like, it's it's like he's psychic. Can I have your attention, please? Firstly, uh, I'd like to thank you all for coming here today. But Carol and I haven't been entirely forthright. This isn't just a family barbecue. We've got an announcement to make. No way. You're getting divorced, aren't you? What? 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 No. You're not having a baby because that's kind of disgusting. That is. That's... And weird. What is weird and disgusting about that? Well, talk about stealing my No, finger. we're not having another child. You'll be dead in six months. Steve. What? Is it the tick ticker? Forget it. Andrew, come in here. Come in, mate. Everyone, this is Andrew. Hello, Andrew. Hi, everyone. Hi. Carol and I have been seeing Andrew for almost ten years now. Ten years? We... Will there be a cake? <laughs> He's our financial planner. I just looked at Steve and thought, what's going on? <laughs> As if it's not bad enough having to come here to Rogers on a Sunday. And now he goes and wheels out his financial plan. I mean, who else has he got hiding here? Brings out his timeshare buddies again, I'm out of here. We're in the timeshare too, honey. Get my point? What about the barbecue? Yes, Tony, there'll still be a barbecue. Pork and fennel. They're not cheap. Look, I think what Tony's trying to say is why is Andrew here? Well, look around. Carol and I are having a wonderful, comfortable retirement. And sure, we've worked hard, but a lot of the credit has to go to Andrew. It's almost ten years to the day when I first met Roger and Carol. Uh, they've been putting off seeing a financial planner for quite a while and... <laughs> Actually, we had this little joke that they almost missed the boat. Ah, yes. The boat. Andrew's right, we had been putting off planning for the future. And then I saw that show pony, Peter Donnan, strutting around in his speedos, hosing down his new boat with his glamorous new wife in tow. That's not a new wife, she's just been refreshed. Really? Wow. Given they were about to retire, it was a bit unusual they hadn't met with a financial planner. But, you know, that's Roger. He does things differently. As people go through life, they normally take photos or collect spoons. Here it is. Well, not Roger. He collects... smells. Burnt rubber. The Datsun 121. I was a bit of a rev head in my day. Here's a lock of Carol's hair from our first date. Freshly cut grass. First day of spring. 1996. That was the year the lavender really took off. <laughs> I never opened them. You lose the smell. Over the years, I've worked really closely with Roger and Carol, and we've really focused on what planners call transition to retirement strategies. In their last years of work, we looked at ways to get the most out of their investments and to maximise their super contributions. Then, once they finished working, their retirement income was ready to go. Now the future's secure and they've been enjoying their retirement ever since. We love Andrew. He's always been really good to us. Hey, Rog, I've got another smell for you, mate. It's the sweet smell of success. No, that doesn't smell of anything. Andrew's a part of our family. Well, actually, the rest of the family haven't met him until today. You'd rather be <laughs> Calm down! Right, here's what's going to happen. Andrew is going to have a little chat with each of you, and just like he has with Carol and I, he's going to help you plan your future. Think of it as a financial intervention, if you like. We've seized all car keys for the afternoon. Any questions? Tony? Just confirming there is still a barbecue. <laughs> 